the Budweiser's back. So we're going to show you how to make rosin. Um, this is a t-shirt press and uh, many times they use a curling iron and uh, Mike's going to show you how to create rosin in this t-shirt press. Go ahead Mike, show them that action. So in this next process from taking our pressed hash that we like to press beforehand, um, we're going to take it and put it between parchment paper. If you don't have a micron mesh bag to use, uh, parchment paper is just fine. You'd want to set everything in the middle and load it into your t-shirt press and with the desired temperature you have you will press down and using this little lock lever it holds down and creates the pressure of the rosin being pressed so what you could imagine it's like a grape being pressed and all the good juices being pressed out of the grape creating a high-end rosin product now in this process you could see as the hash is being pressed on the outside is your remnants of the good CBDs, terpenes, and flavors of the pressed uh, hash turned into rosin. So this is going to be your end product that you would like to enjoy. So in this last process, we used the t-shirt press and we had it at a temperature of 280 degrees for 20 seconds. Uh, we were able to press the hash patty five times. Uh, once you press it on the outside, you'll get remnants of uh, your rosin. And with your rosin, you can just get your scraper and it's so sticky it all just collects to the bottom of the resin patty that you're collecting.